Hello and welcome back to the Ramsey Cool Racing YouTube page. Today, I have gotten the go-kart um, engine off of the go-kart and I, uh, in, in my earlier video, I think it was Saturday I did that, Saturday or Sunday, I'm not really sure, but um, yeah, I got that off and I um, worked on um, cleaning up my sprocket a little bit and my brake um, drum and those things are ready to go I just need an axle now I said before that what um, was made was homemade because that's what I, um, I was told at A to Z and that's what I had thought turns out it's actually not homemade okay um, it's a factory made Manco model 103 10R which is um, it's basically like one of the oldest models that they have on the website I think and it's very very rare to find and um, um, I think I may have found a guy who uh, has all the part or has the go kart, and I'm gonna see if I can um, buy his axle from him. Um, now I'm not really sure if that's gonna work yet, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna um, ask him, and uh, hopefully I'll get it shipped to me. Um, I'm not giving up on this go kart, okay? So uh, yeah, I just need a. I need to get that axle, and once I get that axle, everything will be fine. Uh, here is what I'm, I'm taking the uh, go kart up to A to Z tomorrow, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna just see how that works out. But um, here's what is going on right now. Um, as you can see, the go kart is sitting. Um, can you really see? Yeah, you can see go kart sitting with no no engine in it whatsoever so it is completely engine less the um, engine is actually right here hold on let me show you okay engine is actually right here pretty nice engine um and I'm not really sure if you may saw or didn't see, but in my uh, in one of my um, other videos, I showed that I have uh, done a little modifications to the clutch. I put that on um, with a bolt and a washer because my uh, my set screws did not work correctly. They were having this uh, um, this thing slide off and uh, I showed in the other video that this one of the um, one of the bolts that was mounting the engine down was not work was uh, not coming off so I'm gonna have to get new bolts for that um, but yeah worst con worst case scenario I'm gonna be spending around two hundred to three hundred dollars on that go kart, um, just for the axle, just to get it running and all that. And I, I, I don't want to spend that much, but unfortunately, to get it running, that um, is the complete backup plan. I'm taking it to A to Z tomorrow. They're gonna show me, uh, you know, what what I should do and all that. And I'm hopefully gonna be able to get this thing fixed up fairly soon uh, but yeah okay yeah right now I have nothing to do um, all, all I wanted to say was I found this um, I found the go-kart model it's a Manco model 10310 R they also have it in a black frame and then uh, I think it's a blue frame. I'm not really sure, but uh, yeah, it's a really rare cart to find, and uh, unfortunately, 
um, there's very few of them out there, meaning parts are going to be hard to, harder to get. But I have a couple people willing to sell me some parts. I'm hoping that uh, they are the right type of part. I'm going to check them and make sure. But um, yeah, uh, until tomorrow, I guess, I'll see you next time on the Ramsey Cole Racing YouTube page. Bye. Uh, yes, I am, um, I have this, uh, really rare, I guess, um, model. I have a really rare go-kart model, I guess. It's, it was, uh, Manco, uh, 103, I think. And, um, I broke the rear axle, and, um, I was wondering if you have any, any parts for that. Or if you have an, another rear axle or... Yes. Yeah. Okay, um where would I uh be able where would I um be able to find parts for that uh model? We have parts available here. Um basically if you wanted to pull up our website and look up the part number, there's actually a model that's listed that's one of three. You can pull up the parts diagram for it. All the parts are available on there. Yeah, I, I have the um, operator's manual. I just I couldn't find any um, I I couldn't find any like where to look for any parts for that model or any other model. Uh yeah, I I needed the uh the rear axle. It's um the part number is eight four six one, and I guess it it needs the um the color which is red, and uh, from what I understand, it would be the Full part number would be eight four six one dash ten R. I have no idea what that is. Wait, as far as I know, didn't that model have the axle welded to the frame? Well, it it actually had um mounts welded to the axle, and then I uh, it also had mounts welded to the frame, and then you stick a bolt through the two mounts and. What's that? It says that the axle is obsolete. I don't have the axle at all anymore in any color. Okay. Um, so... I, I, I don't know. I guess I would just have to uh, either make a part or find somebody else with the same cart. Yeah. I don't have, it's unfortunately an older model, so some mm -hmm. of the parts aren't going to be available anymore. Um, and this is one of the, the parts that I don't have. I, I'm also looking for a couple other parts. What, what parts do you have for that model? I, I don't know what you need. Like, if you give me part numbers of what you need, I can look that up, but I don't have it like, listed as what we have available. Like that. Well, um... I do need a uh, brake band. 
which is a 1036. Okay. All right. Um, I I guess I'll uh, I'll would I would I be able to uh, order it online or um is there any other place. We don't have online ordering. You just call us and we so basically can place your order. Okay, well, um, I can uh, wait till my dad gets home and he can order the part, but uh, right now he's he's not home and he has the credit card, so. Okay. All right. Okay. That's fine. Thank you. All right. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Well, that kind of sucks. Um, I don't know. I hope things go well with uh, that. It's kind of a bummer that they don't have that. Um, but yeah, um, see you next time. I know I already said this, but still. Here we go. Bye. <laughs>